Hello everyone, I'm Said Mandegar. Welcome back to yet another tutorial. So great to have you here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up your camera in a small interior space, adjust your white balance and exposure, clipping and environment, aperture, and add realistic effects to your image. Now, let's dive in. To light up my interior space, I will use a V-Ray Sun and V-Ray HDRI. Currently, I don't have a camera, so I will be viewing through a perspective view. First, I will ensure I'm in a proper perspective view, then go to V-Ray toolbar and click on the camera icon. The viewport will change from perspective to V-Ray camera. Now, let's go to the camera settings. Basic and display. At the top, you will see different types of cameras. I believe the still camera is suitable uh, in most cases as it simulates a still photo camera with a rectangular shutter. By unchecking the target, you can manually adjust the target distance. Focus distance if enabled, specifies the distance at which objects are in focus. This is recommended if you are focusing on a specific object in a close-up shot. Sensor and Lens the easiest way to set up your camera view is to work with the field of view. Increasing the amount gives you a wider view while decreasing it gets closer to a close-up shot. If you are a photographer or familiar with real camera setup and want to render a shot that matches other images, I recommend using the focal length by disabling the field of view. One of the most important parameters for small interiors is clipping option. You can adjust where clipping starts and ends by near and far clipping planes. Let me show you in the scene. Since my interior space is small, I don't want a wide shot that distorts the edges. I must get far enough from the scene, but if I do that, I go out my interior. In this situation, I turn on clipping and change the near clipping plane amount until it goes beyond my wall and shows my interior well. Aperture. The film speed, also known as ISO, is the camera sensitivity to light. The smaller values make the image darker, while larger values make it brighter. Always use the lowest sensitivity that captures enough light. Increasing sensitivity introduces noise and can burn pixels in well-lit areas. F number specifies the width of the camera aperture and indirectly exposure. Lower value open the aperture blaze more, letting in more light and create a greater depth of field, which helps separate your object from the background. Shutter speed specifies how long the lens stays open when taking the photo. The slower shutter speeds make the scene brighter but can introduce motion blur. Color and exposure. 
It specifies how the F number, shutter speed, and film speed settings affect the brightness of image. No exposure means shutter speed, F number, and ISO settings do not affect the image brightness. You control the brightness of your scene by adjusting the sun's intensity, size, and position. Physical exposure means image brightness is controlled by the shutter speed, F number, and ISO. In this situation, set the sun's intensity to 1, adjust the sun's size to achieve suitable shadow softness. Exposure value EV uses the exposure value to control image brightness. This corrects color by shifting the color hues affected by the warmth of the light. You can choose from presets, set the temperature manually, or use auto white balance under the camera tab inside V-Ray render setup panel. Tilt and shift. It's always good to check auto vertical tilt when shooting a scene where the camera is not pointing too high or down. Auto vertical tilt prevents image distortion. Lastly, I want to show you the V-Ray Camera Lister. In this panel, you can control all the parameters I explained in this video. Once you set up your camera and take your test renders, you can open this panel and adjust them to get the best result. That's it for me guys, hope you enjoyed this one. Please like this video if it was helpful and subscribe to my channel and click on that notification bell to be informed about the next videos. See you soon, have fun!